I'm in the middle of a swamp right now, trying to help this guy get his wagon. I see one person here. I don't know. Let me see if I'm able to just sneak around. Can I just... Yeah. I'm not trying to have them see me or anything. That's why I'm just leaving the horse way over there. And on my way to this area, I heard a lot of screaming. So... I don't think we're the only ones here. I'm not even gonna entertain the stranger. I wanna see if I'm able to just get the... Ooh. Are you kidding me? Alright, bet. Come here. Anyway, some nerve. Who else? Who else? Who else is next? Come here. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. Also, hit the notification button so you know when I upload my videos. As if, buddy! Where you at? Where you at? Since you want to be brave. Talking all that crazy talk. Got you. Oh, come on, I can't even see him. Come on. I'm gonna get really brave right now and do this. Come on! Hold on, let me run away. Apparently my dead eye is very low, so let me do a little quick puff puff pass. I'm gonna do it again. Come on. Another puff puff pass. Cause at this point I don't even have I don't even have enough stuff for me to properly feed myself to increase my dead eye, but I guess cigarettes would work. There you go. Nice. So far, so good. I'm surprised my health is intact. As if. Come here. There you go. Damn, how many people are here? And secondly, why would you steal someone's... Someone's wagon? Like, cut it out. Get a life. People are trying to earn a living here. You know? Come on. Damn, hold on. Let me do a nice little puff puff pass again. Ooh, that's so cute. And they shot my hat. Yeah, pissing me off. Where you at, fool? Next. Are y'all done? Is that it? Nice. So... Let me go ahead and loot, because at this point, you owe me. Y'all really owe me for... Let me get my hat. The audacity to shoot my hat. So rude. So rude indeed. Poor guy. I'm, I mean, the way that he was acting towards me in the last episode made sense. Like, he was so fearful of me. He probably thought I was part of this gang here. Bendito. Can I go? Wait. Hold on. Wow. Is there anything for me to take here? No, it's just... It's empty at this point. Alright, let me see if I can get something from this man right here. Man, I've ha I'm getting so much goodies. I can definitely go and at least donate to the to the camp here. Thank you so much for your donations. I appreciate it, especially since y'all do owe me. Let me see what this guy has. Nice, seventy-two cents. I killed the man for seventy-two cents. You back to the dock. Yeah. 
I mean, the doctor's trying to earn a living here, and you have the audacity to try and steal his his wagon. I mean, people have no self-respect here. It's kind of like how a week ago I was doing an overtime shift at my job. And somehow, during work hours, these two kids... Oh, come on, man. Alright, you're pissing me off. Bye. Ooh, I slammed into him. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do it again. Come on. Come on. No? Oh, this this man knows. He knows better. Aim weapon. Ooh. Ooh. Anyways, let me go and keep going. Alright, he fell behind. Or not, I don't know. Oh wait! Items. My health. Let me eat my biscuits. Let me eat my bedroll. So yeah, these two kids here try to break into my car and steal my Kia. Which is ridiculous because come on. I'm just trying to do overtime. Luckily, it was a unsuccessful hot wire attempt, but still. Ooh! I messed up. I messed up. Come on. Come on. Are you kidding me? Oh, I have to do this all over again. Okay, fine. So yeah, I understand what the doctor is going through. It's pretty much bull that you're trying to get ahead in life. And yet, something like that happens. Wait, can we go? Oh, come on. Are you serious? Did I accidentally kill myself? All right, let me do it again. Let's go. I'm gonna take it nice and slow. And if I see those guys, I'm gonna shoot them on sight. Yep, I got my gun ready too. Let me go ahead and smoke a couple of stuff so I can increase my dead eye. Man, at this point, I'm about to get lung cancer with the amount of cigarettes and cigars I'm smoking. Alright. Alright, I'm increasing everything. No doubt. Because I'm not trying to do this all over again. Alright, that should be enough, right? Is there really nothing for me to take here, though? Is this good? I am drinking anything and everything at this point. This is funny. Alright, I should be good. Bye. Come on. Bye. I'm running your ass over. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Bye. Oh, I have to do this all over again. This is bull. Okay, so as soon as I see them, I'm going to get out and I'm going to try and shoot on my own because this is ridiculous. I'm not trying to do the same mission over and over again because that's so annoying to me. That is so annoying. Let me see. Do I have any better tonics than this? Okay, I got a Miracle Tonic. That should be good. But my dead eye, though. Seriously. Tobacco? Alright, let me get out. Let me get out. Because I see them. Alright, cool. I see them. Come on. Alright. There you go. Come here! Come here! Come here! Alright, I should be good. 
I should be good. No complaints, no... No detours, setbacks, I should be good, because that is so annoying. I am not trying to do this over and over again, I'm really not. And I don't see any more bad guys, so I should be able to have a smooth sailing from there. But yeah, I definitely understand what the doctor is going through. Sometimes when you're trying to get ahead in life, life just gives you sour lemons. And not like the good sour, I'm talking about the rotten, rotten sour ones where you can't even make lemonade. By that point, when that happens, you just gotta make some iced tea and keep it moving, keep it going. You know, and that's what I've been doing. When life gives you rotten lemons, you make iced tea. That's the healthy alternative from there. That's my advice. Yeah, I know, I'm cotton. I'm just... I'm in a rush. I'm trying to make sure the doctor, the good doctor, gets his wagon back, you know? Thank you for moving out the way. I appreciate it. I just can't wait until the doctor sees his wagon again. He's going to be like, oh my goodness, thank you, thank you. And I'll be like, you're welcome. That's it. Yeehaw, you're welcome. All right, let me chill. Let me chill. Shit. Oh, my goodness. I would be the one. Can I back up or nah? Can I... How do I back up? Oh my goodness. I have to do this over again, huh? That all of you? Thank goodness I don't have to do the whole thing over because this is so annoying. Uh, this is a very oh. annoying mission. Oh, oh my man. I did not count on seeing that wagon again. No, you for that matter. Only people you won't be seeing are the folks who took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Ah, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? It was, no, but it's it okay. Was a pleasure. Yeah. Let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture, he'll be well for a day. Teach him to make one, he might be well a while longer. Hey, oh, sir, okay. Like thank, thank you. Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. That was fun. Can I help you there? Sure. Those are supposed to be my business partners here. They arranged a meeting, I believe, about some horses. A fellow with a scar and a Mexican. Yes, yeah, sir. that's my people. Out by the stables. Thank you. Have a wonderful day now. Ew, they didn't even say you too. How rude. Like, I'm trying to be polite here. And they're just ignoring me, looking at me like I'm crazy. So rude. Okay, so I wasn't able to find my horse. I don't know where J9 is, whatever. So I had to walk all the way over here. And I'm sweating balls at this point. You turn up in this town and you're helping everybody. And everywhere there's trouble. And have oh. you met my partner, Arthur Morgan? He's catching up oh, on shot. something. The sheriff? Okay. Mr. Gray here was saying how he had problems with a family. A family of degenerates. Oh, well, nobody likes degenerates. The hag and her inbred sons. They ruined this county. They killed my uncle, you know. That ain't right. Problem is, we can't be seen to get too close. And? We've got gold, Yankee. We've got gold. I ain't no Yankee, friend. I ain't nothing. My daddy came over on the boat from Scotland. I'm Scottish. And the Braithwaites? Goddamn peasants. I don't know. Mongrels. Slave fuckers. 
All you gotta do is look at them. How much gold? Enough. These are prized horses I'm talking about. Them, they'll get you 5,000. 5,000? For horses? Easy. And where do we sell them, these $5,000 horses? Over in Clemens Cove. Fellow over there will run them out of state and give you 50 cents on the dollar. Mister, you got yourself a deal. 5,000. Publicly, I mean. My sense is we keep all horse wrestling away from the public. 5,000 per horse? Dang, that's a lot of money. On the south side of the manor. That's where they keep the thoroughbred. Yeah. Say less. Passing you. Go on. Man, we're about to steer a couple of horses. Question is, is it really worth it? I mean, don't get me wrong. The price tag is 5000 per horse. But usually with big money missions like that, crazy, crazy stuff cool. always happens. You see the Braithwaite woman? Jose and Sean were planning on going over to the Braithwaites. You haven't seen them? No, not yet. If they're there already, they better keep their heads down. You don't need this to be any more complicated than it already is. $5,000 for horses. We've been robbing the wrong folk all these years. Yeah. He doesn't know what he's talking about. But if we get even a third of that, it'll be worth it. If. A strong if, by the way. How are we gonna play this? The place is well guarded. So there ain't no point in blasting in there. We'll make them think we're there looking to purchase. Three armed men? You'd be armed if you were about to spend 5,000 on horses. We should go in the back way, though. Avoid too many questions. Man, these horses better be worth it, like I said. I mean, I know back in the day, 5,000 was a lot of money, but Careful. still. There's a guard. I'll speak to him, okay? <sighs> All right, then. All right, John. You Work gentlemen. your magic. Yeah, about some horses horses yeah we had a an appointment with mr braithwaite i believe yeah i never heard about any of this a partner wanted to make a significant investment in some stables down here but perhaps we should look elsewhere well i okay then but head on up to the stable oh okay john i see you someone will come see you there you go, big boy. Thank you, sir. You're so kind. I appreciate it. Watch it. Damn, my bad. Yeah. The fact that we were able to get in through the back. That's it. Nice and easy. No need to rush. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. I mean, either way, I feel like that's going to happen regardless. Especially since we have a beautiful track record of ruining every single mission. So, I want to see how this plays out. I'm just curious. And the music's not happening. Right. The music's Let's not happening. E sorry. Ahead. Not Go helping down. either. Because cool. usually when this music plays, something sinister is heading our way. I gotta admit, though, I do like the music. Alright, let's go. Alright, this time around. Let me, let me see what I can do here. Ew, so many flies. I know this place stinks. Alright. Hello there. Can I help you boys? I hope so. Heard you got some horses. We always got horses. Fine horses, I mean. I don't get you, friend. Yeah, you do. Come on. Listen, why don't you get out of here? You, Scarface, and your greaser buddy. Whoa! Excuse no me? We ain't officials. We're connoisseurs. Looking to do some breedings. Come on now, partner. Okay, fine. Follow me. Thank you, man. These are mainly the studs available for purchase or for working 
that's what you're interested in? What is your boys interested in? We represent a famous uh, stable and stud farm from uh, Saratoga. Is that so? Unofficially. Of course. Well, this here's Cerberus. Yeah. There you go, boy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. But you deserve that one. Don't need Bandana, say less. Hold on. Items, thank you. I'll grab the white one in the middle, you get the other two. All right, big boy, it's okay. Come on. It's okay. Easy there, easy. It's okay. I'm your friend. Tether him up to Javier's horse. Okay. Javier, you're going to lead the stallions. Come on, little one. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No te preocupes. I'm not your enemy. It's okay. It's okay. There you go. What a good boy. What a good boy. All right, let's go. This way. Come on. That was Marshall, so easy. Right I'll cover up the back. If there's any problems, regroup at Clemens Cove. Okay. What are you doing? Let's go, quick. Ah, uh, they caught us. I'm not surprised. What the hell are you doing? Stop! Stop! You're being robbed! Shut the hell up. Anyways. Anyways, I'm in the mood to kill a lot of people. Let's go. Bye. This is so nice. Eliminating the competition. Let me go ahead and do a little bit more... Uh, cocaine gum? What? I have cocaine. <laughs> that is so funny. Alright, let me go increase my dead eye. Let's go. Right here. Damn. Let's go. Boom. Right in the head. Right in the head. Let's go. Who else? Who else? Let's go. Got it. Boom. Woo! Got you. And, and I ran you over. Who's behind us? Bye. Alright, let me go and do a little bit more of that to tobacco here. Nah, whatever. Come on. Ugh. I'm taking too long. Anyways, let's go. Let's go. Come on. It's, o it's okay. Let's go. Let's go. I got you. Let me chew some more tobacco. What? As if, buddy. Nice. This is beautiful. We are definitely successful so far. Beautiful horses, too. So if they're 5,000 each, that's 15,000 right there. But that's if we sell, if we sell them officially. Under a table, it'll be like 2,500 each. Bye, see ya. What? He said stop right there. Shut up. What? There you go. Enjoy. Enjoy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Listen, I'm gonna put more tobacco in, in just in case. I gotta admit, though, these stallions are beautiful. So beautiful. One of, the stallions is loose. Keep going. of course, nothing like an extra mission on mission, am I right? Come on. Let's go. Dang, man, I missed. Come on. Right here. Yes. Okay, relax. All right. Come down. Let's go. Come on. All right. We should be good, right? Okay. Come on, let's go. Come on. There you go. 
There you go, boy. Follow me. It's okay. We're not trying to have any loose ends here. You feel me? Last thing we need is to lose a nice little prize horse like yourself, you know? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Clemens Cove is just over there. Come on. Let's get this over with. All right, let's go. Come on. Yep. Well, that could have gone smoother. That'll be on my gravestone. You think they look like they're paying 5,000 for horses? I guess we'll see. How much do you want to bet they're going to lowball us? All right, this should be fun. All right. Let me see. What you boys want? Heard you was, uh... Heard you pay good prices for horses. Oh, we'll buy more or less anything, Pop. That so? Sure, Pop. I'm Clay Davies. That's my brother Clive. We're twins. Okay. John. Arthur. Javier. So what are you, Cuban? No, I don't like Cubans. Can we so, just sell maybe. the horse? Well, what do you care? You ain't Cuban. Maybe I like Cubans. <laughs> Ooh, you're funny. He's funny. Ain't he funny, Clive? Clive don't talk. We're twins, but I was born first. He came out all yellow and black, but he's okay. Ah. Sure. Yeah, I know these horses. They, they ain't yours, but I like you, and I'll give you, I can give you 650 for them. For all three of them? I was told ha, we you're bugging. thousand dollars for them. And I was told the moon was made of ladies' tears. Only it ain't true. Not one little bit. But. I like you boys, but I ain't got more than 700 on me. You want it, or you want to ride them fellers into town, and maybe someone there will hang you. We're going to need more than that. I ain't got no more money, Pop. Here, take it or leave it. We did all of that for 700? Damn fool, Marston. Ain't no one around here got $5,000, boys, but nice meeting you. Marston, you Boy, dead ass yeah. took 700 bucks. Come on. Yeah. Close the gate, Clive. Idiot. The fact that Marston. Man. Imagine we was gonna be wonderfully rich. I knew something was off by this five thousand dollar claim. I agree. It's a bull. And the fact that John was willing to settle for seven hundred, we could have gotten fifteen thousand for that. That is highway robbery, if I don't say so myself. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you guys next week.